My name is Josh Schneiker. I'm the Executive Director for the Seguin Economic Development Corporation and Director of Economic Development for the City of Seguin. My name is Stan Pisarski. I'm Patrick Pope. My name is Ian Burden. My name is Warren Houston. My name is Kerry Rolfing. My name is Garth Bilkey. Robert Haynes. My name is Will Cohn. My name is William Vanderwall. I go by Bill. Our backbone of our economy and the one industry that is just the lifeblood of Seguin is manufacturing. Seguin is a great city from the logistics, transportation, and labor standpoint. The local flair here is, is, is wonderful. It's a business-friendly environment. We are reasonably centrally located for our, our customer base. There's great transportation, so whether that's shipping goods out or the availability of materials to come to us. Good location for airports. And of course, the, the weather's pretty good as well. Seguin is a small community, but one that's very rich in history and culture. Seguin is also an area that really does offer us the modern day conveniences of a largest town, but in a small community feel. Seguin brings a lot of things to the table as far as the people or that small hometown feel that you don't see in much of your larger cities. What I like about it is it's culture. I mean, I'm not interested. It's got just the right amount of traffic, just the right amount of growth, uh, just the right amount of things happening, and I can still get from point A to point B when I need to. Seguin is an easy place to do business, and that the local government, the EDC, wants to help you and support you in your business. Because Seguin is basically rooted in manufacturing, the uh, community gets us. Seguin EDC presented me with lots of resources, networking, and connection opportunities. They've been a great resource uh, to us, whether it was uh, pre-build negotiation. A few years ago, uh, our corporate offices were looking to uh, relocate, and the SEDC stepped in um, and offered certain infrastructure improvements, which made it um, sensible for us to, to keep the headquarters here in, in Seguin. We've really enjoyed the partnership and the openness and the willingness, if you like, to embrace what we're trying to get done here. Um, in terms of partnering with educational bodies, partnering with other businesses, it's really been quite refreshing to actually do business here in Sikki. We work closely together. It's not a me against them. It's, it's truly like being part of our business. Sikki Economic Development Corporation has really partnered with the local businesses. It's no longer about just recruiting businesses into Sikki. It's, it's, it's part of taking care of those businesses as well. The SEDC has helped us by providing us grants, allowing us to grow our company and adding uh, talented employees. The Economic Development Committee here is, is, is amazing. I mean, it seems to me they're just absolutely tireless in what they do. They work to develop a, a business community where it, it actually brings the companies we're able to come together and work on common problems. I love Seguin because it presents such a great labor pool here. We tend to draw people from south and east of Seguin, um, which, is a, which is a strong agrarian background. Seguin for us is very central in terms of our logistics pipeline. So we would have inbound and outbound material supply using Houston port predominantly. But this is a very, very key and strategic location for us here, both for our customers and also for our supply base. Agencies of the city are accessible and they're responsive. There's our great willingness to help. They're kind of that support group that will help you. They'll guide you. Businesses that are willing to help other businesses be successful. Seguin gives us uh, an ability to be very fluid in our business. Uh, we are well supported in the community and uh, the infrastructure is all here to make us a successful enterprise. I'm not from Seguin, so I'm, I take no credit for, for any of it, but that's where what comes into play is the culture of the community. And that culture is somewhat of a Let's go to work. The employees that we've been able to hire in Seguin and the local area have allowed us to grow our company and, and have the success that we've had so far. I've worked all over Europe, Africa, and Middle East. I've managed seven facilities for Caterpillar. And it really is a pleasure and a privilege to be here in Texas. It offers some of the benefits of a larger town, uh, but also the, the, all the good things about a small town as well. It's not the name on the side of the building or the name on the sign as you drive into town. It's the people. It's the people that make Seguin. Seguin's number one asset is the culture of people that are here. So the culture of the uh, people. Without doubt, it's the availability of a qualified workforce with a great work ethic. Absolutely the number one asset is the people. Great people. The people. I would really say the people. The work ethic we get from our employees is second to none. The culture here is one that we work 
really hard to ensure that people can make a difference, you can make a difference here. In order to really understand what Seguin can offer to your business, you need to come see it for yourself. Seguin, Texas, where real opportunity awaits.